Assalamualaikum friends, welcome back to my channel. I am the mentor. So today we are going to be uh, doing the Photoshop tour. So you remember last class we did this. We uh, used a mock-up to present our business card design. So today I'm going to sell you a, a small tour of Photoshop. So at first line you can see there's a Photoshop move tool. The shortcut is V. So it's very simple. You can just move and drag something like and similar to Illustrator. There's a selection tool. You can select everything. So back to Photoshop. So there's a rectangular murky tool which you can crop everything from a picture, and then you can press Control J, become and make an another layer. You don't know. Just Control D to remove it. So there's also one more basic tool which is the selection tool. So for for that you need an image. I'll show you an image here. I'll just copy this here. So with the last class, you just click on the, the selection tool and then press Alt and drag your and right mouse button up and down. So you can do it, but it's a bit laggy for this. You can just right click, the left click, and then uh, you can just change everything, whatever you need. Like if you do this, there's also um there's, um options up. As you can see, the options up. So right now you can I wanna select this out. I don't want this YouTube logo as I just I want I want something else. So I can just select this, like drag it and select it. And now I can press Control J. I'll have another copy of this. You can see, same copy of this. And now I can go back over here and I can remove this. To remove it, I need to go back to selection and then delete. This, you see, it's moved. So now if I want to add something else, I can just go to YouTube, I mean Google and just search anything. You can search, um, car logo. And I can add this over there. So I can, uh, I want to add this one. So copy image and go to Photoshop and just paste this. So click on this. Also take a screenshot and then paste it on there. It's that simple. Just paste it. Yeah, and then put it backwards so that it feels like it's real. And now it's good. As you can see, you can just fix it so it matches it. So you can see it's matched up and it feels like it's real. So. The next one is, so as you could see over here, this is the hearing brush I was showing you. So you can just alt click anywhere, I'll click this one and then outside you can just draw this in. As you can see, I'm drawing whatever is in this circle. So I hope you understood. So I can just go back over here and click, alt click this one. This. And then I can draw this in. Like this. Everything is drawing everything in. Whatever is coming in this small circle as you can see over here. This one. And now, so again if you want to select the whole thing. Select this. And just delete it. And now I can just move it around. For that, I have to delete it because there was a text from, no, not from the image, but it was a text, so I have to delete it. For this one, I have to select this one properly. So let's select IMZ window over here. So when I remove this, I can just drag this away in the white area. So now it's gone. There's nothing here, no traces left. This is the patch tool. So the next, next comes the brush tool. It's very simple. You can just draw with it. So you don't need to really explain this. So next comes the, the stamp tool. So you can just um stamp this this area. First make it bigger. Okay, until uh, until it um, matches this. So stamp it. And now you can stamp it anywhere. See? Stamped. You can just stamp this away wherever you want. With the whole business card I just stamped it away. So it's the same thing as uh, the healing brush and all that, it just copies and pastes it in. So I just undo this. So, you might be thinking, what's the short key for undo? 
and do is control Z. So I hope you like this video. Please like, share, and subscribe. And I hope I covered all the basic tools. And uh, I don't need to explain the easy tools like the pen tool, the text tool, the triangle shape tools, and all that. I don't need to explain that because that's the same thing in Illustrator. And the basic I told you. So bye.